Shalom family. I'm in the book of Jeremiah. If you want to read with me, you guys, turn to chapter 15. Let's read, let's see, let's do 11 through 21. The Lord said, surely it will be well with, you, with your remnant. Surely I will cause the enemy to intercede with you. In the time of adversity and the time of affliction, can anyone break iron, the northern iron and the bronze? Your wealth and your treasures I will give as plunder without price because of all your sins throughout your territory territories. And I will make you cross over with your enemies into a land which you do not know. For a fire is kindled in my anger, which shall burn upon you. O Lord, you know me. Remember me and visit me and take vengeance on, for me on my persecutors. In your enduring patience, do not take me away. Know that your sake I have suffered rebuke. Your words were found, and I ate them, and your word was to me the joy and rejoicing of my heart. For I am called by your name, O God, O Lord, God of hosts. I did not sit in the assembly of the mockers, nor did I rejoice. I sat alone because of your hand, for you have filled me with indignation. Why is my pain perpetual, and my wound incurable, which refuses to be healed? Will you surely be to me like an unreliable stream, as water that fell? Therefore, thou says the Lord, if you return, then I will bring you back. You shall stand before me. If you take out the precious from the vial, you shall be as my mouth. Let them return to you, but you must return to them. And I will make you to this people a fortified bronze wall. And they will fight against you, but they shall not prevail against you. For I am with you to save you and deliver you, says the Lord. I will deliver you from the hand of the wicked, and I will redeem you from the grip of the terrible. Amen.